First time, like I said, I'm not going to be able to interact with you guys too much, but uh, I will be talking. So get excited. This is a fun run to watch. Uh, let's do it. Let's fucking go. Ugh. I am going to rely pretty heavily on sound cues for this run. Oh, boy. Oh, Jesus. Where's my controller? <laughs> it's on the floor. All right. All right. First run of the day, boys. Let's fucking get it. Let's go. And just to just to be sure that you guys know that I'm not cheating or anything, I am I'm going to look away as well. I want you guys to know that this is the purest possible fucking run. No fucking cheating. Ugh. There we go. Got to turn my volume up just a little bit. Just a little bit. Ready? All right. And we went past the thing. Perfect. And then we're going to go a little bit more up this time. And we didn't hit the bricks. But there they are. And it looks like we went straight past, which is fine. There's the bridge. Now the water. Perfect. Beautiful. Oh god, the lag. And now we play with the Yoshis. All right, perfect. There's some really sensitive sound cues right over there. I just have to listen for the bridge. Mostly, I'm listening for the bridge, and then I'm listening for the water because I need to uh, I need to jump as soon as I hear that water, and then air dodge as soon as I hear that I'm I've gotten hit by the the Goomba who's sitting on that little platform. Uh, is that it for the Yoshis? I think that's it. I feel like there's another Yoshi. Maybe not. I don't know. If I die here, that's the campiest Yoshi of all time. Nah, we're chilling. <laughs> I was so concerned there was another Yoshi. I have died to that in the past, and I did not want I did not want to get messed up by that again. That is not a fun one to get messed up by. <laughs> all right. Moving on to Peach and Mario. Once again, we're just gonna run right off this platform, roll into this wall, and then F smash. I'm gonna move forward a little bit here just so I can hopefully get a kill on either of them. Oh, it does not happen there. That's it. Yeah, got him, perfect, perfect. Uh, once again, or yeah, for, for Donkey Kongs, Donkey Kongs are super easy. We're just gonna roll once to the left and that twice and nine out of ten times that'll get them both and kill them as it will here then we have big dk coming up after this all we're gonna do is roll once to the right and then f smash him easy that's just a timing thing i hear him jumping i hear his like footsteps on the middle platform and once i know he's on the middle platform i know he's about to jump onto my platform so it's just a just a timing thing all right underground maze is up next this is the first fun one in the run uh, and first challenging one in the run. Excuse me. All right. We're going to go forward. We're going to roll to the ledge here. Walk off. And then fade left. Walk this way. All right. We got a link. Yeah, I, I didn't hear him making any sound effects for a second there, so I didn't know. Uh, that's the first link. We're going to wait till water. Right there. And then we're going to roll in, get rid of this guy. Fuck, he got us. Oh, where is this fucker? Did he get me again? No. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, we got him that time. All right, there's that wall right there. All right. I can hear the... Uh... Oh, shit, okay. That's fine. We just got to double jump away and walk this way. I'm always able to hear the, uh, I'm always able to hear if I'm up. Hello? No, go away. Wait, are we on water? We are. What? 
Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. Sorry, I, I didn't realize where I was. I'm always able to tell if I'm running up against a wall. If I dash into a wall, it plays a specific sound effect. Uh, and then it also stops my walking. That wouldn't happen if I wasn't running up against a wall. So it's a it's a pretty tricky sound cue, but I can always tell if I'm up against a wall because of that. All right, we're going to go this way. Roll in. That's a link. And when I'm F-smashing here, I'm buffering a crouch cancel to make... Oh, there you are. Oh, he rolled behind me. That has a specific sound effect as well. There we go. Oh, am I invincible? Nice! See ya, Redeads. There's a wall. We're gonna jump to the left. And jump to the left. Another link. Not great, RNG. Die. Die. There we go. All right, we're going to go this way. All right. Jump to the left and two to the right. Hey, and there we go. That's Underground Maze. Uh, three out of five links. Pretty good. Pretty solid. Uh, next up, we're going to fight against Zelda slash Sheik. Once again, I'm going to dash jump over here. Roll to the edge, and then roll in once to crouch here. What the fuck was that? Oh god. Oh, I'm, I'm officially scared. I'm officially scared. This one always goes south. Where is she? She's getting an item. She does tend to prioritize items. Please come get me. Please come hit me. That didn't hit me, right? I don't think so. Uh-oh. That's Starmie. Shit. Okay. I think she's right on me. No? Or not? I think I'm still at the edge of the stage. What is she doing? Come get me! The problem is, my best chance to get her is at the beginning of the match when items haven't spawned yet. But she's so distracted by items. She just picked up like a food or something. She really thought it was worth her time to go all the way down there and get that food and get this invincibility more worth it to do that than to kill the enemy she's fighting. Why? Come to me. Come here. Oh my god. Where is she, dude? She was over here in the beginning. I just fucked it up. Come here. Oh my god, this is so stupid, dude. Why are there so many Pokeballs? There's so many! At this rate, am I gonna time out? This has never happened before. Why are there so many Pokeballs? She picked up five Pokeballs in the past ten seconds. Please come to me. I don't want to get timed out. I don't know what else to do. I think I'm where I'm, I'm supposed to be, but like, why is she not coming to me? Oh, oh, whoa. Oh, yes, <laughs> let's go. I have no idea how much time was left on the clock, but I can't imagine it was a lot. Holy shit, because I think the time limit's five minutes. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> okay, next up is Samus. Oh my god, dude. Jesus Christ. Okay, jump to this middle platform and start F-smashing away. 
Oh, is she up here? Die. Oh, and I need to be crouch, uh, buffering a crouch cancel in between these, by the way. That way I don't get pushed off the platform. Because I don't want that. And yeah, I'm just going to keep F smashing. That's <laughs> what you're supposed to do here. Eventually she'll die to one of these. Die? Yeah, there we go. All right. Escape Brinstar. Let's do this. I have to remember the, the exact pattern. That's it, baby. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Yes. That was a nail biter, too. That one was a super nail biter. Oh my god. Let's go. All right. We're looking good. This is a good first run. This is a really good first run. All right. Next up is Kirby. And green greens. I hate green greens so much. All right. Ready? We're just going to wait. Go. See ya. We're just going to wait right here. Uh, and for this one, since we don't want to get messed up by Wispy, what we're going to do is we're going to roll once to the right and then start up, uh, up smashing. That'll give us a little bit more time when we hear the Wispy sound effect to react and roll the right way. And remember, we don't want to finish... We want to finish this with more than 30 Ready? seconds taken off the clock. Go. One, two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, I'm gonna stop there. Where's Wispy? Stop! Stop! Where's Wispy? Well, it's almost surely been more than 30 seconds now. That's what we wanted. Perfect. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And that way we avoid Big Kirby. I just wanted to wait until Wispy. That way I can avoid... I can hear the sound effect as clearly as possible and then roll so I can avoid being pushed into those blocks on the side because sometimes there's the bomb blocks. And once you get hit by a bomb block, it is damn near impossible to tell what part of the stage you're on. And sometimes it can kill you depending on how much damage you've taken from a Kirby already. Uh, so that was, that was pretty much perfect. Uh, we avoid the Big Kirby fight. And now we go straight to Corneria where we fight against Fox. Hell yeah! That was this is really good so far. See ya. Ow. What is this guy doing? Oh, is he down underneath? Wait, let's see if I can hit him with a PK Thunder. Okay, well, he died eventually. <laughs> if I could have hit him with that PK Thunder, I would have been the fucking craziest dude in the world. All right, next up, we got Fox 2 slash Falco. Oh, it looks like it's Falco? Think so? I don't know. That sounded like Peppy saying Falco. Oh. Oh, shit. He knocked me off. That's fine. We can easily get back up just with a little double jump like that. I'm kind of hitting my bat into the curve there, which is not advised, but 
we, we, uh, we ended up getting the kill. I had to improv that a little bit just because Falco knocked me off the lip there, which is not supposed to happen. Um, but hey, we got it. Next up should be Pokemon Stadium. And all we're going to do here is up smash and buffer crouch. Ready? That is not the last time you're going to hear that in this run, too. <laughs> and we're just sitting here and up smashing the day away. We're looking pretty good. This is actually a very deep run. Uh, next up is F-Zero after this, uh, which is another another challenging one. Um, but, like, we're, we're looking really, really good, honestly. Imagine if our first run, we finally get it. That would be hilarious, dude. That would be amazing. I've jinxed it now, of course, but still, that would be fucking amazing. That would be fucking sick. There we go. All right, so next up is F-Zero. Uh, all we're going to do for this first one is we are going to run uh, as soon as it says go, and we should just barely make it. Uh, before the cars hit us. Uh, and then we can roll back and roll back. Oh. Ready? Go. Except we're playing this on an old version of, uh, of Slippy because the new version can't handle adventure mode. It's sick. Uh, so we're going to go here until right there and then roll back. Then we're going to run. And then once we hear the alert, we're immediately going to crouch. We should be in the perfect position to avoid the cars. I've actually heard before that your ears are, like, you can react to things quicker with your sound than you can with your sight, which is interesting. Perfect. Perfect. Let's go. We can taunt here all that we want. Let's go. That's a perfect F0. We can just run to the end. Next up, we got Falcon. Oof. Getting a little nervous now. Now I'm getting a little nervous. <laughs> Alright, next up is Falcon. He's gonna Raptor boost. And I grabbed him. I'm sick. Oh no. Get out of here. I really do need to kill him as soon as possible. Okay, we got it. I shouldn't have... I, I went for a new strat there to try and forward throw just to see if it would kill. It did not kill. Uh, but because the longer that stage goes on, the harder it gets to kill Falcon. Um, so I got I got pretty lucky there. Next up, we've got on it. We're just going to do a simple uh, double jump over to the left. Hopefully, that'll bring some Nesses with us. And then we're going to roll in here. And start swinging. And listen for cars. Perfect. It's hard to telling on that stage. That one's actually really, really hard just because I can't tell which nest noises are mine and which are the comms. And then the Mr. Saturns, I'm hitting the Mr. Saturns the entire time thinking that it's a nest when it isn't. It makes, there's so many sound effects happening that it's hard to hear the cars, and that's what you really, as long as you don't get hit by the cars, then you're fine on that stage. All right, next up. Holy shit, we're already at Icicle Mountain. <laughs> this is the farthest that I've gotten in a real run. Hopefully we get the Icicle Mountain song. If not, I'm going to sing it out loud uh, and hope that I get it. Um, if all else fails, jump more than less. That's what we're going to hope. hope. Okay, we're hopefully going to get the song, though. Hopefully we get the song. Because I, I have a whole, this one's basically impossible to do blind unless you jump in sync with the song. Because um, the stage is the same every time. Um, at least to a certain degree. I don't know if at a certain point when you go high enough it uh, changes. But All right. I'm really nervous. Could you tell? <laughs> I'm really, really nervous. <laughs> Fuck! I got the alternate song again. 
Not supposed to jump there. Do 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 now I'm just gonna jump until I can hopefully find the ice climbers. Please. Oh! Holy fucking shit. Holy fucking shit. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> Fucking shit. Okay. Okay. I've never made it this far. Everything from here on out is cheese. Everything. Every, holy shit. Okay. Holy fuck. Okay. I have to calm down. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've never made it this far. <laughs> holy shit. I've never made it this far. That's the hardest one. That's the hardest one. And we did it in our first run of the day. Oh my god. Oh my heart is fucking pounding. Okay. Okay, next up. Next up, we've got the wireframes. Wireframes are going to be super easy. All we need to do is up smash. It literally takes zero skill. Then after that, we have Mario and Luigi, Metal Mario and Luigi. They're going to immediately drop through. I'm going to grab the first one, forward throw. I'm facing to the left, so I need to forward throw left. Then the other one is going to quickly jab me. I'm going to turn around and then forward throw the other one that way. And then it comes to, to Bowser, and Bowser's just a matter of F smashing. Um, we could always get messed up by an item, could always get messed up by an item. Um, but guys, we're in a really, really good position here. Um, okay. Okay, let's do this. No flubs. Zero flubs, dude. That's, that's all we're hoping for. And, like, not terrible RNG would be good, too, especially when it comes to Bowser. This is our first run of the day. We have done this on literally no practice. All right, where are you? Come on. <laughs> there you are. Okay. All right, forward throw to the left, and then get jabbed and forward throw to the right. Metal Mario and Metal Metal Luigi. Ready? Go. Done. One more. That's it. One more, dude. <laughs> One more. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, we're going to roll twice so that we're in the center of the stage. We're going to make sure that we're buffling, buffering a, uh, a crouch cancel. That's the most important thing is to buffer a crouch cancel. <sighs> Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. Hopefully there's not a fucking bob bomb or something that spawns. It's all up to R and Jesus now, dude. It's all up to R and Jesus. Hype in the chat, boys. Get ready for the biggest fucking pop-up of your life, dude. Get ready for the biggest pop-up of your fucking life. Ready? Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my god. He's so close. There's his first up B. That's it. That's it. Yes! 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 Oh, I'm turned all the way around. Let's 
Let's go, dude. Let's go. Let's go, dude. First run of the day. Let's go. <laughs> Unreal. Adventure mode, blindfolded, one stock, with Ness. One of the worst characters in the game. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh my god. Where I can't even get my controller is like wrapped underneath my chair. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Look at Ness. Let's go, dude. That wasn't a follow, that was the game. Oh, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> that was the game, wasn't it? That's my follower effect. That's hilarious. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. I was not expecting first run, dude. Um, hey, if you're watching this on YouTube, <laughs> thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe to me, or subscribe to me, you can, you can do whatever you want. Follow me on Twitch, uh, twitch.tv forward slash Nihilus5. Um, <laughs> and it's in the description, I'm sure. I am, that is crazy. Holy shit. Uh, shout out, also, very quick special shout outs to Mervis McGurvis. Uh, Mervis McGurvis has also completed, uh, uh, Melee's Adventure Mode, uh, very easy one stock with Jigglypuff. Uh, this is the first time it's, this is the second time it's ever been done. Uh, first time it's ever been done with, uh, with Ness. Um, but shout outs to Murphs McGurvis, go watch his run. Uh, we, we competed with this run for a while. Um, holy shit. Uh, uh, so special, big special shout outs to Mervis. Um, let's go, dude. Bam. Oh, let's go. Okay, time to kill two birds with one stone. Beat All-Star very hard with Ness. Dude, while we're here, might as well, man. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I did it. I can't believe I did it. All right. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Whoo, let's go.